That's right, welcome to Xeno Gears. Xeno G Ears. Um, did I not press Boton? I'm already bad at this. Oh, right, because this, uh, this switched confirm and cancel with FF7. That's fun. That's really cool. Why? Oh, it didn't? I just took too long to press the button? Okay, could have sworn I hit X. Doo -doo -doo -doo. All right, load them boys. Wait, what? Oh, that's because I'm with Seton in the pirate's lair. Pretty cool. And we need one more item for me to get the uh, desert item, Chiva. Cool. Yeah! All right. Hi, Bart. Oh, I hear I hear computer noises in the background. It's not uh, not my brain going nuts. Oh, that's the chief navigator's banana boat. Speaking of banana boats, hang on a sec here. Do, 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 do. There we go. That's much better. even worse when you dive underground unexpected boulders and underground waterways you can't take your eyes off that map for a sec don't worry I do want to see the ship's chart I am dying to see this chart <gasps> cyanide did you, did you say the B word Dazil okay Satan's house <laughs> Hey, why do you guys have a uh, Satan's house on this map? It is no matter. Pay, pay no mind. Dazzle. Eeg. The Eeg. Alright, cool. What a neat map, sir. I'm very impressed. I miss the days when entire nations consisted of four discrete locations. Hi, Mike. Me too. <laughs> oh, those were the days. Man, I cleaned this controller the other day, and it feels so good. Like, even... I, I even, um... I removed the analogs, and I gave them a good scrubbing, and they feel so... Like, the texture on the pads is real nice. Franz! Yes. Oh shit, it's Scoody Babalubi to be Ludi. Akai 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 what a joy. Akai 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 what a joy. Originally, oh yeah, uh, well in Japanese his name was Bobu Vida. You might not know that. Calm Bonwa Bray Cats Gank Desk. Uh, yes, I am, I am, I am filled with sufficient gank. I want to hear some hot sounds that Franz has recorded. The Franz Collection, number 85. Yeah, this is cool. These are great. New sonar dropped! <laughs> Guys, the 2022 sonars are out. These are hot sounds. What if I hear all of them? What happens if I do hear them all? That was number one! <laughs> oh man, hi Broken Quest! Yeah, I love the dolphin people. Is there a Blu-ray release of these? Not yet. Square Enix is too scared. Alright, I've already think I've already heard 77. I just love the idea of a dolphin wearing a full body jumpsuit, and it's got it's got 
sleeves for his flippers. As long as there's no flipper babies, right, Doc? Well, there have been a few flipper babies. It was only a couple of flipper babies. Get out of there. Get in here. <gasps> Elevator action. We're going down here. I need a map. I need a Chizu. <laughs> Nope, wait, this is where I came from. Disregard. I am exhausted. Um, it, but it's all good. Because I'm going to get a good night's sleep and then I'm going computer shopping tomorrow. Oh, now that's a tea. Alright. Almost at the hideout. More like we're at the hideout. I was trying to um, take apart my green, my beautiful translucent green DualShock 1 to give it a good cleaning. Because, like, it's it's fine. It's mostly fine. It, it just has never been cleaned. So I'm like, well, before I make it my dedicated stream controller, let's give it a good cleaning. And one of the screws is stripped and just will not come out. So. That controller is sealed for eternity. And I've tried computer shop and get some good deal. I'm gonna nuke. Uh, I tried every stripped screw strat or S3 program that you can name with the exception of buying a dedicated machine that does just that. I tried, I tried the rubber band, I tried the super glue, I tried the hammer. It, that thing ain't coming up. The S3 program. I had to make a full-blown reinstall of Windows on my PC and now all my settings for FF... Oh no! Did you never... Did you not upload them? It's a good, it's a good idea... Sandboat... Hi, Kauriko. It's a good idea to get into the habit of uh, uploading your FF14 settings every once in a while. Fortunately, I used to do it a lot. Because I would play at home and at work. And if I change anything on my hotbar, I would upload the settings when I was done, then download them when I got to the other place. Yeah, good to know. Yeah, you can do it from the login screen. There should be a little gear icon. You should get in the habit of uploading your uh, stuff every, you know, once a month, maybe. Oh, who are these kids? Bort, who are these urchins? Have you been associating with urchins? Bart, good to see you back! Welcome back, Bart! Oh, they love this guy. New model gear and two people that we helped out. <sighs> oh! He found a Jurassic Park. Cool. Thanks, fucking spoiled kid. Yeah, right? Well, then I'm gonna tune up my gear a little. Why don't you two go have some tea with old Mason? I'm gonna do that. Maison. I'm gonna have some tea. Analog things. These analog sticks feel like new. The controller, like, it's kind of, it's a little bit dingy. If there was a way to, uh... I don't know, is, is there a retro bright for, for PlayStation Gray? Although I imagine you could just use the same deal as people do for Super Nintendos, right? Because I really want to get this thing looking like new. Because it feels good. Now I need to get it to look good. Now I'm coming, buddy. Oh, it's me. All right. I need to find out where this chest is to get this Chivo.
<laughs> Which way is north? Alright, very cool walkthrough. North is east. That's fun. That's always fun when you just pick an arbitrary direction to be north. I've, been, I've gotten so fucked uh, trying to find my way to places here in Japan, because sometimes you'll go... You'll you'll be leaving you'll be in in the subway and you'll there'll be a map of the local area and you're like oh this will help me get to where I'm going and there'll be a super tiny little symbol somewhere on the bottom you got to it's some real where's Waldo shit that says north and it's pointing like to the southwest it's not great uh, hang on it would it would be nice if you know IRL maps sort of realize that, hey, when you look at these things on your phone, uh, north is up. Uh, wait a minute, what's Xeno get? Oh, that's a boss guy, I don't need that. Alright. Where am I now? This is a door. My room, enter and die. Oh, I'll enter. Cool. I'm in the bard zone. Yo. <gasps> oh, that was it. Hey, that's a Chivo. That's what we wanted. Thanks, Bart. <laughs> you did it. I did it. Boo -doo 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 -doo. Eat my shorts. Eat pant. Is that what? Okay. Okay, so uh, apparently X is not just the open door button. It's the open door and enter button. When you open a door, you are locked into an arrangement with this door. Oh boy. Please take a seat. Wow, cool tea. Well, I suppose his sprite was mostly on that seat. Famous tea? I, well, don't mind if I do. Whoa, they're drinking it with their psychic abilities. Shao Kahn's minions! I gotta fight Shang Tsung! Bartholomew Fatima. Ed... <laughs> Ed Bart! Oh, Ed Bart. Rip Philip Fatima BRB.
este? Uh. <clears throat> Hi, we're back. Satan loves a royal gossip. He sure does. If only there was some royal news in the real world. He'd love it. He'd be over the moon right now. Unfortunately, nothing's happened. Edibort. Edibort. <laughs> Officially, yes. However, in reality, we rescued the young prince from Shao Kahn's evil outworld. Well, gosh. Well, that's why the prince is rightful to resort to piracy. The piracy boards in there downloading a cracked copy of Minecraft. Because it's fun. I guess. Pi Racy. Oh yeah, you know what? We have uh, we got Chiefs coming up. I gotta be on the lookout for. I can't. I can't rest on my laurels here. Now that I've uh, gotten the two I was after. Oh wow! Retro achievements is, uh, is now announcing. <laughs> you would NFT steal a gear, would you? I sure would, Quest Morland. Um, don't foil that royal. You wouldn't download a royal lineage, would you? <laughs> hmm. It's not a bad idea. Uh oh, I knew it was this guy. I knew it was this fucking guy. This Tau. I'm gonna I'm gonna see what he was playing here, and I swear to God, if it was some Silent Hill horse shit, I'm gonna be pissed off. Oh, retro, goddamn it! <laughs> yeah, it's this fucking guy. I thought you were still playing Silent Hill. I was give, give, I was gonna give you guff. Oh, uh, how's it going, man? Oh, you beat that Silent Hill crap. Nice, man. You were playing retro. What retro were you playing? Now I'm playing that. Oh, so, oh shit, you're on super. Wait, what? Yeah, super goals and. Wait. Who is this that we keep hearing so much about? Yes, super goals and ghosts? That game's hard. Yeah, super goals and ghosts. <laughs> super goals and goblins. Oh, you just made up a remix game. It is Xenogears. Hello, Kailuya. No relation to Cecil's dead. <laughs> Uh, Silent Hill, I'm coming. More like a gun tow your drunk. Oh, mean. Um, next up, we have to receive the hide and seek badge, which I think is an easy achievement. But then there's also one that's just called receive a free meal. What the fuck does that mean? And they're missable. They're all missable because the guy who made these is a fucking mountain wizard who doesn't communicate with the outside world. Get a thousand points or more on Merry Go Pop Hard. That sounds awful. Let's have fun, shall we? Well, thank you for the raid, Tao. Tao's gonna help me uh, buy a new PC tomorrow afternoon. We're gonna hang out in Osu, and I'm gonna look at machines. Got a bit to go. Oh, we got a bit to hide and seek. Wow, I have no achievements to worry about right now. Then I just get to enjoy the game. This is so foreign. To this is alien to me. Not Shao Kahn's guards. We needed power. You're going to suffer through a mini boss rush with your unupgraded. Uh. Wait, can I upgrade before them? As in, like, it starts now? Don't I have access to the shop? Legacy of the Wizard. No, because you can't downgrade. Wait, what? Wait, I'm not allowed to downgrade later? Are you sure? Oh my- NAMI! Wait, <laughs> NAMI's back! Hi, NAMI! They get the gloves and some other items. I gave up drawing a map, though. I just used a guide. Didn't know anyone is supposed to figure out that damn game? Yeah, I saw you- wait! Oh. Except for gear accessories. Wait, so I, I'm, I'm allowed to upgrade my accessories? Do, 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 do. 
Feels like it's unbeatable that a guide. Gross. You have to put the old ones back, though. Wait a minute. Because <laughs> this man is a sadist. Yeah, absolutely. Boy, this text crawl is... Uh, Wish we could speed it up a little bit. I am much relieved by your words. Oh my god. Lemonade? Yes, please. You are my best friend. Got the Rafamal MC you tomorrow for big computers. Yes, Tao, I will see you tomorrow, 2 p.m. at the temple for big computer times. Thank you, dude. Thank you for the raid! I'm so excited to buy an actual PC. Mother Marguerite. Why would Shao Kahn take her captive? Oh no, not the Fatima Jasper. Are you getting a pre-built? Kind of. Yeah, more or less. Uh, Tao says he found a place in the mach- well, the shopping district. The ma the machine quadrant of the shopping district. That has a lot of, um, used- just used big beefy monsters. Similar to the ones that he uses at work, and he uses big beefy monsters at work. Uh, he says he found some particularly beefy boys that are a fraction of the price they would be if you were to actually buy the parts separately. The only deal is they don't have... The, 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 the GPU is very old. But can run Xenogears. So until I, until I can actually source a modern GPU, I can just use that. Will you do an I'm a Mac and I'm a PC drop with Tao when you buy a PC? Yes, of course! No, wait, because we're both PCs in this scenario. Did I tell you recently that, uh, someone told me Justin Wong? Oh no, I gotta eat a banana. Hang on a sec, folks. This, this takes precedence here. I got a lot of work to do right now, as you'll see when I put the banana in. Hill, hill, 
Grammarly can help you write quickly and confidently, so you never have to slow down at work. Instant corrections make your writing mistake-free, while keeping it short, sweet, and fitting in tone. Oh, that was good. That was a good break. Good banana break. Okay. All right. Well, simmer, simmer down, donkey. We'll be back. We'll be back to pick up, pick you up later. All right. Keeg get. How's it going, Keeg? Okay, okay. They are finally here. They are finally here. Oh yeah, I wanted to. I wanted to tweak Voce. I wanted to do something today. I'll do it next stream. <clears throat> Don't worry, Vo Voce is not going away. He's just getting better. I mean, primar primarily Voce is not going away because he cannot be killed by conventional mortal weapons. <laughs> I love that. That's that's where you went to first. You're removing the profanity filter. No, I don't think I don't think I have any say over that. That's not on my side of Voce. I think that's just how Twitch is. Twitch demands polite robots. Voce is a lander. There can only be one. There can only be one. Yes, I'm gonna teach in Portuguese. Which um a lot of Portuguese spoken here in Nagoya. There's a setting on- What? There's a setting on Streamlabs? No. F wait. Bullshit. Turning Voce into a VTuber? That would rule, but no. Check the form topic for the game, and yeah, you can't change gear accessories for fights, but there are some character accessories that will 100% be needed. So- Wow. So I can't change- When can I upgrade my gears, I guess is my question. <laughs> when can I finally upgrade them? This sucks. This guy's a whack job. Four fifths of the way through disc one. Okay, so f <laughs> um, four fifths of the way through disc one. So um, most of the way through the game. What would a senior Voce VTuber avatar look like? I imagine an old-fashioned CRT monitor with a big mustache. <laughs> that sounds pretty good. Picture scrolls. Please remove the profanity filter from my programming. You want to be able to say fuck without the weird spelling. <laughs> the weird spelling. Wait, hang on here. I'm gonna I'm gonna follow this I'm gonna follow this weird keyguard advice and go to Streamlabs right now. And if I don't see any option, I'm gonna yell at Keyguard. Sort of a custom here. Actually, I don't think there is. I was just checking. Uh-huh. All right. We're just going to close this tab then. Thank you. All right. Oh, God. I was stuck in the lunch dimension. There we go. Master Faye, please relax. Mm -hmm. 
Is that my phone making noises? The Eeg. We must stop the fighting for making any more orphans like her. Cool. Cool base, Bort. Love your base. Can I stand on people? Sure can. Xeno Gears. Good lord, I ate my dinner very fast. Hi, child. I'm waiting for my dad to get back, but I'm not gonna cry. Pretty good, huh? That's really good. Oh, I hope you're her dad. Daddy! There we go. <laughs> Welcome home, Daddy. There, there. If you've been a girl by obeying the nice lady. Yeah. Oh, she wants pre- God, all these pirate kids want presents. <laughs> pirate dress-up kit! Oh, wow. She's, she's very happy. Um, I can upgrade my own characters though, right? There's nothing in the achievements that <laughs> says a dog can't play football. Or that I can't buy stuff for my dudes. And I've got a lot of money. Yeah, you know what? Let's buy, uh... Let's buy 15 Guardian Rings. No. Buy gear for your characters. Yay! What does Guardian Ring do? Can I... It just says... Attack defense, but it doesn't tell me what it fucking does. <laughs> oh no, here we go. No, it just increases defense. Get out of here. Agility plus one, defense plus two, attack plus two. But what? It, what is just? What's just increases defense? Is your prey available on Streamlabs alert box? General settings up enough. I don't know if that affects the text speech, but it might. You can't get the main accessory that will affect gear fights until later. Ah, okay. Hang on here, Kiguar. I'm gonna check that. I'm going to stop what I'm doing to check a hunch. Alert box, general settings. Pretty sure that it... Uh, pretty sure it should be turned off. Where's my general set? General settings. Profanity filter. Enable standard bad word list. What is the standard bad word list, though? No, disable. Anonymized names containing bad words. Apply profanity filter on recent events. Do -do -do. <laughs> Replace bad words with happy words. Naughty words in your area. Uh, Alright, try it now. Might need to grind money to afford it. Yikes. Fuck. Yeah! Oh, we did it. Thank you, Kiguar. Um, I'm really curious what this guardian ring does, so I guess I'm gonna buy one. Just out of curiosity. He's free. Fucking fuck shit, I am free. Oh, beautiful. Thank you, Wish. Bless you, boys. Oh. Fucking bless you. <laughs> Does it, though? This is, see, okay, st this makes sense. Defense value plus two. And then you look over to the right, and you see defense, and you see a plus two. What is this bullshit? Increases defense. But it doesn't, though. What are you on about, game? I'm equipping this anyway because it was 2,000. Holy shit. This is the part of the movie where Voce's eyes turn red and he has a menacing smile. Oh, no. Whoa, we're getting into elemental stuff. Hard star. 
Blue star. Water up, fire down. That's the way we like to clown? Oh, I don't want to remove that minty status effect. I have to know what the hell this does. What does increases defense do if it doesn't increase my defensive stat? I hate this shit. Alright, so you know, gears. Guardian ring. Resetting my status bars and keybinds after 14 will be the death of me. It's, yeah, it's not great. Character command guard makes character unable to evade, but gives him a 95% chance to block the attack and take out damage. What the hell? What does this do? do, 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 do. Garden rings reduce the damage that you take when you block. Now you'll notice later in the game the characters will block sometimes. Okay. Yeah, sorry about that, Spruce. Let that be a lesson to everybody. Should I buy a speed ring? This, these don't affect any of my stats in my gears, right? Because, man, I would, just, I would just buy some speed rings. Not even the gear sets are so... Yeah. I mean, on the plus side, the gear set thing is not going to be that bad. You just have to equip a weapon and then click optimal, optimum, and then save it as a gear set. Just do that for all your jobs and that's it. But, yeah, the... um. Ugh, setting your hotbars is the real annoyance. I get made when my desktop icons get jumbled up. I couldn't imagine the pain of fixing that mess, mad asterisk. A study school. Alright, I'm not sure where to go, so let's just uh, run around. Let's explore Bart's base. Oh. Or the overworld. It's all good. Cool hideout. I didn't suspect a thing. The song has lyrics and I used to listen to it a lot. I imported this soundtrack. I forget what buttons do. Wait, so wait, X no longer confirms? Oh no, it does. I just selected exit because I'm a big dummy. Here we go. File. Yeah. Yeah. Uh Can I Oh cool, I can explore. I am streaming under Xeno Gears. I figure, you know what? Fuck it. Why don't we? Why don't we uh, make ourselves easily findable by the diehard fans of whatever it is I'm playing? Oh crap! Doo -doo -doo. Oh, okay. Oh, it's just me. That's fun. Yeah, sure. No, no. Yeah, you know what? Fine. Uh. Whoops, that's not anything. Neo Tin Robo. Don't you douch. Should probably be in my gear for that. But you know what? He's dead next turn anyway. Could you not? Just blocked a bullet, baby! Uh, mm -mm. Oh no, he's still alive! He's gonna hit me with his big old foot.
How much? Okay, fuck it. How much HP do those things have? I thought I could take it out in one or two. Maybe I can! <laughs> no, okay. Gotta go. I'm president of the Xenogears Fan Association, and I'm here to enumerate on the ways. all the ways you are playing this fine title wrong. Yeah, I am a man punching a robot, but you know what? Isn't isn't it my nature? Isn't it Faye's nature to defy God? Isn't that the whole theme of this game? Is not a crook. Name one thing I did wrong in that fight. I dare you. <laughs> Atakand, death on God. Atakand, death on the God. All right. Well, back in we go. Okay, okay. Fucking a trattino basso. Fucking trattino basso. Hey, kid, let's kill a guy. It'll be fun. Well, oh, gee, I don't know, Mr. Graf. Hi, Andy. Number one. Italian man TTS distracting from the majesty of the narrative. The majesty of the narrative? Are we watching the same game? Hang on here. Do, do, do. Where's my walkthrough? Hmm. Oh boy, yeah, we got bossos coming up here. Who the fuck are you calling Italian? Hi, Nami. Voce is Vo Voce is molto italiano. We do know this to be true. <laughs> Hi Bart and Satan. Hey, this place is incredible. Hi. They probably don't even have equipment like this in the capital. Oh. Listed a response. Hey, Faye, don't stand on the screen. We won't be able to see. Oh, sorry. Bosso is baffo. Bosso is baffo. Oh, yeah. New Nomo Wo out on, on Sunday for you Patreon folks. I, ha I, ha I gave it a sneak listen. It's pretty good. Oh, cool. Five hundred years ago. Making a blood oath with giants. That's how I like to spend my weekends. I look forward to it. They say he used the strength of the giants to found Ava. <laughs> the spe his special file is a supercut of people getting hit in the nuts for <laughs> heavy. Oh, that's true. <laughs> Faye, you must see this. Look, he was hitting the groin. Next, 500 years ago when we could make gears but we didn't understand perspective in art. Yeah, it's, uh, well, I, I think we're finding out that the gears are not uh, man-made or of this earth. Jasper! But football in the groin had a football in the groin! Gebler! Kimmy Gebler's looking for it. Is 
Sadly, I've forgotten most of the Deep Xeno Gears lore I obsessed over 20 years ago. Yeah, same. Basically, all I remember is... You kill God. Basically, God is kind of like a Lavos. Where he just came to the planet. And, I don't know, he's chilling in it? Uh, and church is bad. That's all I remember. And Satan gets a cool sword, and Billy has cool gun moves. It is a bit murky on where gears originate, but there are definitely new ones built as well as old ones on Earth and Restore. Well, yeah, I mean... I mean, I knew that there were also new ones being made, because there's whole nations building armies with gears. But I mean, like, you know, shit like Weltall is well old. I want to know about God. Billy gets cool gun moves and then gets completely written out of the story. Did it with Blanc. Oh no! <laughs> Why did he say Groff and my father? This is this is one of my um, one of my least liked uh, tropes, though, is reluctant hero who just doesn't even see his own ability. He's just like, I just want to, I just want to go catch dragonflies and go fishing in the pond. I don't want to fight in your war. You just killed 500 dudes with a flick of your wrist. I don't know anything about fighting, little old me. Get the fuck out of here. Get in the robot, Faye. Spoiler, well told, Faye's mom and also his girlfriend. Okay. We're gonna help service gear. Wow. Phrasing. Let's go. First time he got in a robot, he blew up his home. Yeah, right? But like... Shouldn't he also realize that that's an incredible power and he just did it wrong? <laughs> but he can still do it? Face harkening back to Achilles in the Iliad, who stayed in his tent and refused to fight. <laughs> well, this game is the silly ad, if you ask me. Oh god, why wow, she's still happy about that pirate kit. Nope, this is the tea room. Senior gives innovation over here and realizes that your mother slash girlfriend is also a Virgin Mary analog. Uh, it's getting real complicated. Give it up. I do not know my way around this gosh dang pirate base. This is it. Nope, this is absolutely where I was. Where is the gear bay? Do, 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 do. do, 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 do. Complicated. He he he. Bwah ha ha ha. Whereas Evangeline just, though, crosses and shit looked cool. Xenogears is all religion. Which bit's better? Alright. This is the Savo room. Let's leave. Crosses do look cool when they are explosions. That is also true. You know what's cool? Right angles. Okay, this seems... There we go. God damn it. Is... Oh, it's duh. It's this. Elevator. Go down. Evangelion, Xenogears, Bomberman. Oh yeah, it's true. If you don't have a Lance Longinus in your game, can it even be considered a JRPG? No. Japan passed that uh, legislation, which they call Longislation, <laughs> uh, ten years ago. <laughs> I guess I gotta talk to my robot because it's lonely. Boop, boop, boop. <laughs> oh god. Don't scare me like that. 
I don't want to talk about it. No, oh, bored. <laughs> Why are you giving me longitude? Lance Gislation was taken by that Lance Bass law. I know. That was unfortunate. God, that stupid microphone! What's it doing? Is that better? Sure. No. Lance of legislation? That's close. We're getting there. I feel like we're getting warmer. I miss the days when you could catch any kind of fish with any kind of pole. <laughs> I know. Oh, man. Yeah, Spart, you clearly love fighting. What? You love fighting. Good work killing your village, dummy. Yeah, Satan told me you leveled your own hometown. I also enjoyed the naming inspiration the Ava Rebuild movies have taken from Kingdom Oh no. <laughs> yeah, that, it's... Oh, I don't... Yeah, I reserve comment. I'm just going to say that. See, now the text is readable. All right, well, I guess... Uh I guess I gotta talk to the mechanic. Full rudder! The fuck are you talking about? Oh, that's FFT music. Not Xeno Gears. Three point oh plus one point oh thrice upon a time is a perfectly chromulent fourth movie title. <laughs> uh that shit man. Evangelion, Kingdom Hearts, um pretty much every anime ever created. Uh Japan, which is is, you know, famously not great at English, consistently ranks at the bottom of the uh at the very bottom of the list among Asian countries when it comes to English. But when it's time to create movies and shit. Hey, you guys, you know what we know the best? English. Let's show the world. Yeah, do that. Uh, oh, good. I can't get on this. I think I need to save because I believe I'm about to be plunged into battle soonish. And I don't want that to happen. Off your butts. You can't, hey, you can't say butt on this program. Um, okay, apparently that's the only place to go. Wait, yeah. Okay. 
Yay, mini boss gauntlet. That's fun. Is there a save point around here? Oh. That's not mine. Where's my... No, okay. That's mine. But, uh... I do get to save before that, though, because don't I... Don't I go sweepy buys? Complete with quirky mini boss squad. Nice. Is something interesting finally gonna happen? <sighs> I guess you could call them black boxes. Wow. Cool, mysterious, and deep. All ah, right, okay. <clears throat> Faye. Yeah, we want to have a word with you about your weird ass gear that no one's ever seen before. They're actually the secret murder power boxes. Resetting everything in FF14 is a nightmare. But it doesn't come close to when I thought my character was gone because I had to choose data sets. Uh, that's happened to me before. I thought I bought the expansion for the wrong... Because I, I have two Square Enix... Um, not accounts. But I, I have two FF14 licenses because I bought it originally on PS3. And then instead of just use the same license to play on PS4, when my friends bought me FF14 on PS4, I just... For some reason, I just started. I hit, or maybe the way that it was purchased, it had to be a new license. But yes, yeah, so I've got this old ass FF14 license, which is uh, license number one. My current one is number two, and it gets real confusing anytime. I'm, like the whole reason I had to get on the phone with Square Enix tech support was to tell them I accidentally registered it to the wrong account like years ago, and I had to talk to this guy on Square Enix live chat. Tech support chat. And I had to be like, yeah, um, I accidentally registered Bloodstorm to the wrong uh, service account. Um, do you mean Stormblood, sir? Yes, whatever. Buy me Stormblood or go to hell. But yeah, he was he was able to transfer it over, fortunately. But man, that that kind of shit, you gotta phrase it just right. Because I've seen, I've seen horror stories online, like, they called up and they explained it wrong. And if you do that, it's already too late, and, like, they can't do anything, because you've already used the wrong terminology. Like, you can't tell them... Fuck, what is it? I think, like, you, you can't just tell them that you registered it to the wrong service account by mistake, because they're not allowed to fix it if that happens, but you have to... There's a, there's a way to phrase it that I looked up before the tech support thing, and it worked out in the end. Screen account management seems a bit better than it was back in the Play Online days, but just barely. Only fans that pass the Stormblood test can have their account transferred. Oh no, I failed it. You know, I never thought I'd say this, but uh, I think I do, you know. I, it would be great if we could fit more dialogue on the screen. Maybe it was like the PS2 era where we, we had a nice happy medium of like a uh, font size versus, uh, you know, text on screen. Because these days I feel like it's too much. Fonts are too small and there's too many words on screen. But this is like, font is very big and there's like three words in every text box. There's got to be something in between. Where do I go? Can I just talk to my gear, please? To pass the test, what is the name of the Moogle in the Evil East Alliance raid quest line? You have five seconds. Um... Kuplo Cop? I accidentally deleted one of my FanFest glamour items and I didn't realize it for ages. Oh no! What was it? 
Oh, that sucks. Smoggle? The desolation of Smoggle? I always talk to tech support like Ralph Wickham. Yeah, right? Oh, the high summoner's boots. Ah. Alright, there's Bart's gear. Can I go, please? <laughs> I hate this. Look, if you're gonna put me if you're gonna put me in this fucking boat, give me a map. All I have to go on is a shitty ASCII map that the whoever made this guide drew, and it's not good. Let's try this again. I wanna go east according to this that that rules. What? Yeah, I want to go east. This is not right. This orientation is all off. Yeah, the compass is taking up like a quarter of your screen. They can't fit a minimap too? You wouldn't have any of the game left. Uh, I would kill for a minimap right now. Just Game, I don't know the labyrinthine insides of your sand ship. Can you throw me a fucking bone here? A, a quest marker. Anything. Yeah, Kaurico, I know it can go rest. I don't know where the fuck to go, though. <laughs> where is anything? I've been stuck in this gear hangar for 84 years. Um, the, the map I have says I'm supposed to go east, but sure can't. I'm in gear hell. Go north. Go north. Back up the elevator, okay. Alright. Oh, it's good tea. Tea's keeping me sane. Oh, right, this, uh, god damn, I keep forgetting this is a fucking elevator, it just looks like a platform. Oh, boy. Alright, let's, uh, check our map again. Bum, 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 bum. Wait, I want to go, according to this map, I want to go south, no, that's Bart's room. Oh, uh -huh. oh, I see. Okay, so yeah, the guy who made this map is just wrong. Oh, hang on. I'm trying to get my bearings here. You know what? There should be a rest and a save in here. I'll take it. What kind of tea? The hectic vexed. It's just straight up kocha. Good old black tea. There's an item in Bart's room we can get, except I did, because I got the achievement for it already. What? Andy's got Taco Bell? Andy, share the load. Ah, uh, Kaoruko was lunch chew. Yeah, that really... It, it wasn't an item in Barth's room I can get. It was an item in Barth's room I had to get. Because of this goddamn get all the items in the desert achievement. <sighs> Thanks, Benjamin Ghazi. Um, technically, but since Bart's lair is in the desert, you'll need that item as well for the achievement. Thanks, dick. Oh, shit. Well, it's not a crook, because now he's making this happen, so excuse me for just a moment. i got to attend to this very important matter, if you'll just... Uh
zneka tak vodu pjaka tak. That was a good snack attack, whack attack. It was good. I bet that was fucking good. It was! And Hectic Vex to spawn, it was new Jarvis. Thank you. A Ruarian dance. <clears throat> now where was I? Oh, that's right. The unending shit desert. <coughs> oh boy. I'm good. All right, I saved. I, uh, I healed. Can I do it? Ooh, I'm in your bunk bed. Okay. I want to go up this bunk bed. Wow. This looks kind of fun. I don't know if I would want to sleep on the top bunk. Oh, he's reading a book. I'm reading Beat It. Ah, oh, see, we found the pirate bay. That's right. Um, yeah, I'm ready. I'm okay. I'm so very tired. Oh God! Oh Jesus! Bart, can you oh can't you do that in the morning? It's Bart Uh oh. Uh Well this is fun. <gasps> Broyer! Whoopsie, I keep bashing my mug off of my mic. Oh god, I forgot about this bullshit. These surface dwelling hyphen lambs hyphen sure live in a nice place. <laughs> Rank! Oh. Rank looks like he is from the 70s Gundam shows. Yeah, he definitely, yeah, he's definitely a stock character. <laughs> Stratsky. Oh boy. Dwer mods. All right, Spariel is now in place at the back. Oh no! Pandemonium. Not gears. Gonna save again. <laughs> gears of war. We don't know that for sure yet, Kiguar. They could be on some sort of peacekeeping mission. You've never broken into an enemy uh, sand ship on a just to tell them everything's all right. Oh, 
Oh, you're back to playing this again where the bugs fixed? Arby's, there were no bugs. It was just a shitty achievement that I eventually did. Gear inspection. That guy's not the gear inspector. Well, better get down to my gear. Ah, <laughs> I sound like Voce gave up halfway through. Turned out the only bugs were us. Oh, that's deep. What if, like, we're the parasites on the Earth, man? Did you ever think of that? It's real deep. Well, Arby's, I wouldn't go that far. I wouldn't say it's fun, um... But it's... Playable? I don't know. I was talking to my buddy Paul about this today. Uh, at work. It passes the time, that's the expression. Triple deck of bunk beds, that's right. And I told him the only reason I haven't rage quit... Well, I did rage quit this once, but now I'm back. The only reason I haven't quit this permanently, this or FF7, is because, uh... I have all the achievements so far. So far. I haven't missed any. So far. Which means... Yeah, sure, I'll play it. But I, f I feel like as soon as I find out I missed something crucial, like at the beginning, I'm just gonna be like, oh, fuck this game. <laughs> But, for the time being, I've got everything. So let's, might as well just keep it going. Hi. Yeah, that's me. <gasps> Technically, Will, thank you for the follow. I hope you like Xenogears. Even if you don't, we'll have some fun. Hello! Hi, night boy. That old man, he called me the Slayer God. Keep the okayish times going. Oh, thank God. That alarm. My strength. My home. My lanta. Oh, okay. Who, who, mm. Am I fighting? Am I doing a fight? Are we doing some violence? Oh, it's my buddy Bort. Damn it! Young master, is that Sigurd? They're approaching. Oh no, okay. Uh, mmm, okay. I got two, uh, two goons, two bark goons. Well, I guess we're- wait a minute. I know how this works. I'm wise to this. Sword knight. Oh, I control these dudes too, huh? Alright. Oh, my goons don't get combos? Boost and go ham, huh? Well, I guess, um... Then wait, should they be doing... I guess they should be doing... Yeah, right? Fierce attacks? Let's get boosting. Nice try. Dingle dongle. Wait, how did I actually do damage? <laughs> I mean, sure. This guy just doesn't happen to have the defense that Calamity did. I mean, he's certainly not as beefy. It's still weird. Yeah, okay, Calamity was a tank boss. Yeah! Yeah, Arby's. I mean... The gear stuff, I think, is pretty cool in this game. Um, yeah, the battle stuff is cool. I like the death blows. Nice sprites, cool animations, and then your gears, you got nice, you got cool gear models. You're doing robo fights. Uh, but I feel like a lot of the, the cutscenes go on very long. There's a lot of really obnoxious uh, techno babble. Not just robo tech jargon, but also like 
philosophical horseshit. Oh, get in there, buddy. But I mean, like, like any good anime or JRPG, this game is so far up its own ass that you don't even care anymore. Because that's, I don't know. <laughs> Isn't that why people are drawn to those genres? I mean, look, I love JRPGs. They're my favorite genre. Um, I, and I'm, I'm, I'm at the point now where, like, I don't really get mad if a game is so far up its own ass that it's like, well, Xenogears. Like, you know, put, <laughs> putting hyphens around keywords, because that's cool. Oh, Wild Stallion, eh? <gasps> Bill? Ted? Yarg. I remember when this came out, that they bragged about how long this game was. <laughs> yeah, they really did. I remember that. I, rem I remember the... the 80 hours got thrown around a lot. And I'm like, yeah, hell yeah, hook that shit up, hook it to my veins. Oh. It's Fricassee Friday! Um, to Satan? Yeah, he's gotta have combos, right? I didn't give him any. G no. Sazanami. Nope. Oh, he weakened my armor. Or did he? <laughs> that's an FF14 sound effect. No, yeah, that's the... Huh. I don't think he has level 2 combos yet, does he? Oh, uh, he does not. Which means... okay. It's always Frickasy Friday when you Frickasy, and that's a problem because I never get a weekend. Oh, no. Dun, 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 dun. That's not what I want. There we go. Oof. Metal Gear. Yeah, me me yeah. Metal Gear is another series like that. That's the creator is is so full of himself that it should be in just interminable, and a lot of it is. But I don't know. Metal Gear, I think, comes in the end comes out to be more fun than something like Xeno Gears or I don't know a big ass anime. I don't know, just, how, just that's just how I feel personally. That, that's my taste. I can put up with that bullshit because Metal Gear does some fun stuff. Fun, goofy shit. They're, oh no, they're using hyphen drive hyphen. Battle enhancement drugs. They are using drive. They are using drive. Okay, I think we're still good here. No deaths. Bo -bo -bo boost, buddy. Port. I'm not even sad about hyper anime video games. This game is just really boring. It kind of is. I want to ease off the boost now, save fuel for the big boss. Whoops, I guess that's. Guess that's what I'm doing then. I will bust down my ether though. D b uh, mm. Bye. Wow, tough boys. Wait, what's Renki? Next, ETH affects all. 
Yeah. Is it because Metal Gear mixes anime bullshit with American movie cheesiness? Cyanide, that might be it, actually. I think it's like it's that weird combination that makes it surreal and as a result kind of fun. Anime is just anime. It's always just gonna be anime. But yeah, stuff like Metal Gear is like, because it's a weird mix. It's diluted with something and that kind of lets, I don't know, kind of lets each half of it stand apart better and work better like as a whole thing. Xenogears is on its own. Xenosaga is connects with homages to Xenogears. Xenoblade is all standalone. I've only played Xenogears. Xeno something is a franchise went on to be fairly... Oh, right. Okay, explaining to Hectic. Anime, you bitter pill. Someday you'll all grow up and realize anime is good. Actually, <laughs> is not a crook? Not likely. Actually, my wife is watching... Uh... A pretty good anime right now that I don't know the name of, but it uh, it's on Netflix. And I was watching some of it with her after dinner, and it was very good. It's, it's just about a Yakuza dude who quits to, I guess, be a house a house husband. I don't know. Basically, that's the kind of shit that I'll watch. I'll just sit down and watch something dumb with my wife like that, like. Not basically nothing that has story arcs. I think that's exactly what I am not interested in. Just episodic, episodic bullshit. I think is the way to go. Not wands, night. Yay! What about arcs turns you off? Um... Uh, yeah, no, I, I don't mean story arcs in general. I just mean, like... I don't have the time to be sitting down and watching, like, 30 episodes of a show to get one story. You know what I mean? I gotta stream Xenogears. <laughs> you probably 40 years stronger basic attacks since they actually hurt now. Oh, nice. Like, I, I haven't been an anime guy... Or I'm not, rather, for the same reason I'm like, I'm not really a TV show guy in general, is I just, I don't want to waste dozens upon dozens of hours to get a season, you know, to, to have one story. Uh, they're all linked in that they were developed by the same team, but they are not plot interconnections, I think. So the trailer for that last time, I was going to Netflix. Yeah, Kura Finn! It is very funny. It's very cute. It's, I mean, it's nothing against the media, Me media being the plural of mediums, not like the mass media. Nothing against the, the medium, it's just like, I don't have time anymore to devote to watching that much TV. That's funny to me because that's my reason for not being a TV guy, but I am an anime guy. So, see, to me, they're exactly the same thing. It's just, you need to invest dozens, dozens and dozens of hours to get a story. Which I feel is a very long-winded way to go about getting a story, but that's what TV is designed for, because they got to show you advertisements while you're, you know, you're watching 22 minutes of content over a 30-minute period. But even, but even, even stuff like Netflix, like I can't, because if I do, I will never stop. So I just don't start. Here we go, and you know, Alex ranted about the media. Oh no, I mean I know anime by and large is TV, but you get yeah I do, but yeah it is like. Anime is mad TV. Not to be confused with mad TV. <laughs> Which is good. Um, that's why you farm FF14 relic weapons and say, Vomino, yeah! Because guess what? I can do that while listening to podcasts or music at the same time. I'm doing two things at once. With TV, I gotta fucking stare at this rectangle. Just passively and just be like, you know. Damn, this is dumb. Why don't they, why don't they just kill that bad guy? <laughs> Is this the boss? I already went off. I'm staring at you in a rectangle right now. Exactly, Kiguar. I'm, I'm questioning your your uh, 
soundness. Like, I like streaming. You have all three for the- oh, okay, alright. So I can just go nuts on this, dude. Well, also, did you watch WandaVision? No, I didn't, because we don't have Disney+. Plus. Staring at the Alex Tango while I do my FF14 crafting. Yes! Mike's doing it right. Alright, maybe I do want a boost for this guy. Or not? No, yeah, because I already... Alex Tang. Staring... Yeah, the Alex Tangle. Like, this is this is different from watching a TV show, because this doesn't really have... This isn't like a start-to-finish story. This is like... It's a live stream. Hey, today we're playing... We're playing Xenogears, and I'm going to complain about it. But would you watch a Xenogears TV show that was half as long as playing the game? No! No, I would not! I might read the book, or the short story. It's interactive- yeah, this is kind of interactive media. And like, the, yeah, and honestly, yeah, this is only fun for me because I get to interact with the chat, I get to hang out with you guys, and we get to have this conversation. Yeah, like Kikwar says, we're all hanging out here. But like, if I were to just watch a TV show, that's just me alone in a dark room with a sad rectangle. Whoa. I know Kung Fu! I don't even know on a TV. There we go, he's down, alright. I think it's just because I spent so many years hoarding DVDs and box sets and having media. Like, yeah, you know what? I can watch all nine seasons of Monk whenever the fuck I want. But I never did. Or I did once, and then they just sit on the shelf. I think if you broke most RPGs down to TV shows, I wouldn't watch them. It's hard to find a truly good... Yeah, right? Exactly. Most media just ain't great, but that's why there's so much of it. Because, you know, every once in a while, something sticks and is good. All right, so I'm looking at these in, in order. I just want to confirm there's nothing here. I'm pretty sure there's not. Yeah, right? This is all... Margie. Also, yeah, watch MonkOnline.com. Wait, really? That's pretty good. It's like, yeah, I've, I've definitely come around on episodic TV. All episodes? That rules. Like, I, like, I think it would be cool to watch an episode of Monk before bed. But, like, if I were to watch an episode of some ser- some, uh... Oh my god! What is this? Some serious shit that has a continuing story arc. I can't watch one episode before bed. It would turn into seven episodes before and during bed. Boss time. All right. What about little, um... <laughs> All I know about Little Monk is the, the tiny bit I, I stole for that drop. I've never actually seen Little Monk. All right. Satorn. He's good here. We are on Monk. It is a jungle everywhere. It is a jungle everywhere. Sure is. Spiral. Oh, God. Oh, this already sucks. Time to boost and just kick ass. Ah, I kick ass for the Lord. Boy, this guy also seems real tanky. Hey, 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 where are the monks? People say we're solving some crimes. After Calamity, all other bosses seem easy. Yeah, Calamity was just designed to be a, a butt stuff. I kind of still don't want to use my heavy attacks just because I want to conserve fuel. Stop screwing my board. Nice. Oh crap, I forgot to boost my boards. Clang, clong. Did we manage to do the thing? Seven pains? We did. Well, I did it off stream a couple days ago. 
Because I had some time before work, and I'm like, yeah, I'll try that while I'm drinking my coffee. And I did it in three fights. Oh, crap. Shouldn't have said he was a customer. Boost my board. My board needs a boost. Grats, thank you. Jordani. It was a real pile of puke. What a shitty achievement. I did I did post on the achievement page right after I got it, just like, hey, this took 33 attempts because uh it's 10% preparation and 90% luck. I don't think this is a good achievement. Like I saw the I saw the set creator arguing in the FF7 thread because he also did the achievements for FF7 and he was arguing with somebody because somebody was like um, uh, dial eight one one eight one one for your free sample of board booster today I will thank you there wasn't an, an, an achievement in FF7 to beat the rock paper scissors thing which is just it's straight up RNG it's just it's like a one in nine thousand chance every time you load up your game that you're gonna beat it and everyone was was attacking this guy like you can't expect us to sit here and do this and I think his rationale was like well I found the RAM value therefore I should make it an achievement everyone's like no please though this is awful and he, he actually argued actually it's it should be okay that it's an achievement because there is an in-game prize for it and the in-game prize for it is 300 GP at the gold saucer 300 fucking GP and to him that was the rationale that oh of course it's justified there's a prize for it in game isn't there therefore uh, you should have to put up with this one in 9,000 bullshit and everyone's like dude no and I think eventually enough people complained that they they took the achievement away but like this is the same guy who made the calamity achievement which yeah come to think of it that has no in-game reward uh, would you watch a Xenogears TV show if it were six episodes long and me and Kigor came over with snacks to watch? Is not a crook? Absolutely. Broken Quest can come too. Uh, if he brings wings. Uh, okay, Kigor, if you're gonna bring Benghazi, you're not invited. This achievement guy, I don't even know what to say. Yeah, right? RNG based Chivos. It, that, like. Oh, uh, it's the worst. But I'm, I'm sticking with it because, the, not you know, the whole set's not like that, but there are a couple jewels of the set. He didn't even fold on it? It was the other achievement creators that voted it out of the main set. Oh shit, he didn't- oh man, I believe it. This fucker. Tie up Benghazi and make him watch you grind his terrible boss. That's a great idea. Just the fucking gall to- what is, what is this weird, childlike desire to play God because you're the first person to call an achievement set? Well, I call it first, therefore, it's my it's my responsibility, nay, my duty to make everyone else suffer. How about go fuck yourself? How about the site is for making achievements so people can have fun with games, not grind so much that they start to hate the games they used to love? You fuck. You can actually see your armor lost, defense down on the right, so you'll know you need to heal it. Wait, what? Oh, yeah. Because he's unhappy the rest of his life and thinks he needs to flex down some people. Bingo! That's it. Wow, my wife and I had this exact same conversation yesterday about one of her coworkers who's just being a huge bitch at work all the time. And I said that pretty much. I was like, yeah, she has no power in any other area of her life. That's why she's a bitch to you and everyone else at work. And my wife's like, oh, yeah, that makes sense. Did you know Benghazi made the DK64 Chivos? No, I did not. Some people get corrupted with even the most tiny amount of power. They do! <laughs> it's not great! Time? What is time? Oh, till my turn. Don't hit me. Uh, wait a minute. 
Armor loss, defense down, armor loss. I see armor loss. Wait, armor loss is defense down? He also made FF8 Chibo, so just, yeah, I think we're not doing FF8. Oh, fun. How much HP does this cone wanged Chungus have? Defense is reduced by 40%, you could heal it or keep smashing. I mean, he ain't hitting me, so. Clang, clong. He goes by Benghazi. Yeah, right. We call him our pal Benjamin. He's hitting me now. Eh. Oh boy, oh. Clang, clong. Should have been keeping track of this guy's HP. Yeah, our pal Benjamin sounds like a sitcom title. <laughs> that would be that might be a fun sitcom where we just follow this dude on his on his day to day life while he makes achievements, and usually, in the end, the ending of every episode is him just getting the fuck beat out of him when he ventures outside his house. Uh, hmm. Do I need to re up on the wild smile? At least the FF8 set puts the- Oh, thank god, somebody taught- Somebody taught him how to use the site properly. This putting it in the icon bullshit has to stop. Just- Dude, how about use- Just follow the rules of the fucking site you're developing for, really? Would you, for fuck's sake? I mean, I give the icon a glass effect so you know that it's missable. I put a star on the icon so you know that it's missable. How about just follow the fucking rules and put the M in brackets? Can you do that? This guy is <laughs> very much not a team player. Rules exist for everybody but him. Or hear me out, do fucking both. Yeah, even better. Like, th that way you get to do your fun little creative thing. Uh, and you also get to do what the site requires. Worse than the FF4 TV creator because at least, yeah. Yeah, I freaking see, that's true. Well, here's the other part of that though. Now he, now he does know, he has known for half a year and just doesn't care to fix it. But yeah, like, this guy's just being, do not play for fate. Yeah. You mean the set? Because I like the game. I defeated Big Dick Robot. The th thank. Yeah, okay. I mean, I saw there were triple triad achievements where I had to have all rules active. And I'm like, no, I'm not doing that. Oh, it's no junction. No. Oh, okay, so not playing the game. So that's fun. Again, that's bonus, that's bonus set shit. This guy doesn't understand what Retro Achievements is. Once again, he's just, he's hammering out achievements and submitting them and then sitting back, his sunglasses fall onto his face, he crosses his arms and he goes, all right, asshole, solve this. When that's not the point of the whole site. It's basically a shitty version of the speedrun. Oh. All right. Alex podcast about theoretical game achievements called Alright asshole, solve this. <laughs> <laughs> 
as I should. That's what the that's what bonus sets should be called. No, uh, they just live at low HP and do limit breaks or whatever it's called. I think they're called limit breaks, right? Is that about doing a retro TV podcast? No, no, nobody wants to hear that. Also, I don't have enough material for that. I've said all I have to say about uh, <laughs> retro achievements on here and on Nomo Wo. I think I, I, I think I do this exact rant on Nomo Wo on Sunday. This coming Sunday. Apply now. Apply now. That's not it. <laughs> uh, all right, asshole. Solve this. Sounds like a Nomo Wo. No, it, it sounds like <laughs> it sounds like the most confront confrontational NPR podcast you've ever heard of. <laughs> Welcome to All Right Asshole, Solve This. I'm Mike Siegel. Cover art is a dude squatting and pouting with folded arms and sunglasses and shorts with the title and word art. So the rules. <laughs> now I kind of want to do that. <laughs> oh. I'd like to save. <laughs> Oh, uh, yeah. Like it's like wait, wait, don't tell me. But it's <laughs> wait, wait, go fuck yourself. Oh, <laughs> uh, oh man. Now I, I kind of. <laughs> okay, okay. Go fuck yourself. Wait, what? The guy who made the FF6 chief was working on Lunar. Oh, that's, yeah, tele Televandalist? Yeah, he does a lot. He gets around. Uh, that'll be fine. That's cool, because I did, I requested Lunar Silver Star Story. Actually, I, re I removed my request for Mother 1 and 2 on GBA. After Earthbound, I'm like, ah, I'm good on Mother for a while. We can put that request to use elsewhere. Wait, wait, go fuck yourself. Has to be a real <laughs> Oh, man. Has anybody done a parody of Wait, Wait, Don't Tell Me? There's definitely parodies of NPR, but, like, that's a very specific kind of, like, just, just, your suburban mom type of humor, where it's like, <laughs> they almost said a swear. I'm gonna make a parody of Nomo. -o. That's very cute, Kigor. Request oh, yeah, fuck, I keep forgetting about Azure Dreams. That game rules. FF6 was a solid set. The shitty parts were legit the fault of the game, not weird achievement bullshit. Yeah, that was a good set. I really like that. Um, the only part I kind of got mad at was having to grind all the rages, but it just, you know, just took some time. It wasn't like... I w it was RNG dependent, but there were, there were ways to... Not ways... I mean, you can reliably manipulate it on hardware. Um, but there were there were ways on Retro Arc that were not as good, but almost as good. I didn't even realize there was an Azure Dreams on GBA. Um, do I get cute dialogue? I do. Arg, that's no good. Okay, this is a this is a clumsy mistranslation. I think what he's trying to say, I think the Japanese is something along the long lines of Dameda, as in like, don't even think about it. You can't enter my pirate, my room, my pirate room. But instead, in English, he says, Arg, that's no good. Rages are a unique and important part of F6, where 300 points at the gold saucer is nothing. Yeah, right? Okay, where am I supposed to go? Up to the bridge? Come on, Cranky, take it to the bridge? Alright, hi guys. Gotta go. Did I? No.
Where the hell? Oh wait. This is the right, this is the exit. I don't want this, do I? Not sure what your schedule's like, but RA has scheduled time attack. Yeah, I saw that! I saw that. It's um I like that they're actually saying that now instead of just you know, forcing me to find out when I kill Mother Brain and, and two achievements out of three don't pop. That's pretty fun. So keep that in mind if you plan on streaming 12 hours from now. I do not. 12 hours from now, I am going to be in Osu buying a computer with Taurinensis. Check out this walkthrough. Wait, what? Yeah, the bridge. Wait a minute. Magnetic coats can be bought here. These eventually stop being sold until resurfacing around chapter 43 and heavily increase a gear's resp. This is one of the three places to buy as much as you need. Well, I, th I feel like by the time I can actually change my gear's equipment, I can buy them freely, so... Forget about it. <laughs> Nami, it was a success. Alright, um, where's the bridge? Feck. Aww. Do, do, do. I don't know where the bridge is. Is this it? Boy, wouldn't it be cool if one of these doors was marked bridge and they weren't all just identical doors? Take it to the bridge down the elevator. Oh, down the elevator? Is that how bridges work? I thought the bridge was like at the top of a ship. Sort of in the frontish. Can't equip many ways to save your money for ether doublers. Oh, right, okay. I got confused. But can I understand why you need to? Should I learn how to coach Evo just so I can do Dragon Force? Yeah! I'm gonna vote yes. Let's go, Sig. Move all Zigs. Zigs. <gasps> Yo. Oh, I'm on a sand boner. Let's move. Let's go. Uh, go where? Oh, I have a map. Thank God. Thank you, game. Are there are there encounters? Still can't move the camera with the right stick. Square, square soft. We'll figure it out someday. Today's not that. Uh, okay. I was trying to go to the menu to save, but I guess this also does that. Was the Dual Shock out when this game was released? Yes. Do 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 do. Yeah, I don't know when right stick for camera kind of became the norm, but uh, it was definitely after this. Well, um, hello? Excuse me? <laughs> I'd like to, um, uh... I'm, I'm Tokyo drifting all around you here, but how do I get in? Can I jump? Can I press triangle to jump? Wait. That. Wow. Neat. Exit the ship and walk in. But I forget. Okay. Yeah, I thought I was hitting it earlier, but I guess that's... Oh, it's circle. Blithavich. There we go. Yeah, I know. Calico, the whole game is Chivo Hell. There's no escaping it. 
Why do I like this music, though? <laughs> or I did. <laughs> Game, I'm trying hard to enjoy you, and you're making it so tough. Why is this so slow? We are all trapped in Chivo Hell. We cannot escape. True. I had a dream I met you in your life. Red. Let's do it. <laughs> oh, I wish it did. I kind of like this music. Slow down version of boss music. Oh, this is intentional? I thought Retro Rock was just having issues. Band's falling asleep again. Get them to turn on their boosters. No, yeah, that's pitched down. This is intentionally slow. Yeah, you're right. It's not, yeah. That's... That's a choice. That's a weird choice. It's so weird. Like, for people who already know the game, it's just like, what's wrong with this track? Docking complete. There is a Brando's Court Cl Yes, Seven Pains. That is true. Ramses. <gasps> it's Miang. Beep, beep, beep. Shao Kahn! Well, well, Commander. You've only just taken command already. You're achieving splendid results. Wait, is this the dude with the with the fucking blue plus over his face? <laughs> it sure is. Ramses, the Oh man. Oh, never change Japan. This weirdo. Holy cow, guys. Two 10 pound bags of Kingsford charcoal is 1688 at Home Depot. Grilling time is here. Nukes, everything okay? Um, is this, is this a promoted account? I'm gonna grill up burgers. Hell yeah! Grill up some burgs! <clears throat> I'm Alex of Berg, and I approve this burger message. I'm getting sushi. Sushi's a kind of burger. It is in no way a burger. But using propane and propane accessory, yes. I cannot take the, exp the, the phrase Fatima Jasper seriously because Jasper was the name that my grandfather would use for anybody whose real name he could not remember. <laughs> hey, hey there, Jasper. So, like, I just think of this this Xenogears MacGuffin that nobody can remember the real name of, so they just keep calling it the Jasper. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sushi is made of metal. <gasps> oh, I forgot about her. Okay. <clears throat> Hi, I'm Rams US. She is Miang. We would like to ask some questions. Kiguar, yes he did. Congrats, you are keeping up with the story. Jasper Freel, well, he was a Mastrodi. I'm Margie.
All right, she wants cake. Oh, she just wants to go home. It seems like he's not even hiding the fact that she's being held hostage, even though she's kind of too dumb to understand it. Or she's playing dumb. He's just kind of like, yeah, we'd like to keep you here until we find the treasure. Thank you. Please in enjoy this beautiful room and bed and food. See, that was pretty cool. That was slick. Oh, oh, mm. It's a little of both. <laughs> Truth serum. He just produces a bottle of whiskey. We must find the other piece of the Fatima Jasper. Ah, oh, yes, your perfect little room with a chair to sit and look at your painting. Yeah, right. <laughs> is, is that how people used to consume media? Media being paintings? They would have a special desk in a special room just situated in front of a painting. Instead of asking, you know, instead of borrowing DVDs from a friend, you'd borrow paintings. You'd swap it out for yours. Dude, have you seen... Have you seen... Season 4 of The Mona Lisa. <laughs> it's really good. I like this music. Okay, this is what I... This is what I was enjoying until the game interrupted. I mean, the meets of the soundtrack, that's never... That's never gonna get on my bad side. Damn kids, they always staring at their paintings in their elegant chairs. <laughs> elegant chairs. Elegant balloons. 7 p.m. My new painting is on. All right, so now I'm in. <sighs> now I'm in place. Ah, hide and seek. Now wait a minute. I'm I'm looking at this walkthrough, and it says now I can. I can also go to Road to Nissan. I can enter Nissan and buy an Ether Doubler. Can't enter past the Kislev War Camps. So there's nothing much else to do. Is th is that missable? Should I should I bail on this and go there now? Do -do 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 -do. I guess we can just do hide and seek. Right. Uh, go into a small alley entrance where two poor kids are to find them hiding. Cool. Ether doublers are important. So, should I leave? Get back in there. No. There we go. All right. Yeah. Oh wait, that's nope. So wait, do I just want one? Do I just need three? I just need. I just want one for each. What's this? What's this tree? There it is, road to Nissan. Whoa! That oh. We're going deep under if we're going under the river. 
an incredibly practical vehicle. Cool. Uh, I'm always able to relax more when I actually have some kind of freedom in an RPG. I, wow, I don't remember this at all. But I love the music. Like, I, okay. Let, let me lay this out. Like, I, I prefer JRPGs in general to Western games, specifically sandbox games. Because I kind of like to be constrained. I like to have parameters. I like to be put on a set course. That being said, I also like being able to deviate and explore from that course. But I like that that course is there for when I am ready to get back to it. Don't mind me just exploring this um, playhouse? Sounds like you're being difficult. <laughs> space, I am not. Hi, space. Right, nothing is labeled here. That rules. Oh, I hear you, buddy. This looks shoppish. Yeah, that's true. Wait a minute, is there... Obtain every item in Blitivik. Is there a, uh, obtain every item in <laughs> Nissan, Chivo? Kislev... Shivat. Oh. Doesn't look like it. Huh. Welp. I guess we're just looking for this ether doubler and then I'll get on my way. This is definitely a shop. Look at this thing. Look at this. You got a signboard out there. Look at that. You got paintings. Ooh, phase a painter. He loves that shit. <gasps> What's this? Was what that a brown? I can do that. Oh boy. I could just angle the camera down a bit. This is driving me crazy. That, no, no, okay. Mm Alright, so we gotta be here. North. Easy, easy peasy. We started south. Let's just go all the way through. Wait. No. Well, it's not the cathedral that's going to be selling robot parts, is it? You never know with this game. Sir, do you do sell ether doublers? Okay, it is in the town.
Did I know Vexine existed? Yeah, Bart's getting real touchy. Real defensive of his castle. Okay. Pretty sure I... Okay, this is Barrel House. Have we been in Barrel... Yes. No. Yes. This was the Playhouse. I've been in both of these, right? Yep. Yep. Mmm. All right, walk through. Can you be a little bit more specific, please? If you like exploring things, uh, Roads to Nissan is open. It has a nice shop that sells a couple rare items. Oh, wait, it is on the map? No, of course it's not. Yeah, the ASCII map just has a blob that says Nissan to the south on the right. This is south. That, that, not Barrel House. Hmm. This could be it. Oh, this looks promising. But I got a free special herb tea. Classic shop move. Wait, are there three levels? Because this is upper. No, that's exit. That's okay. Oh, south on the right. I guess that would be southeast. This looks southeast ish. Hey, buddy, what do you got? <laughs> oh, just leave while she's talking. It's so rude. Faye, what's wrong with you, man? Looks like I like this. This is a good looking town, this is a cool looking environment. Right, look at that. Look at this moss covered these moss covered railings. Look how cool this place is. Oh man. It would also be cool if the game also had a map southwest of here, okay. been here. This is art town. Boo, 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 boo. But is there another southwest? No, that's where I came from. Been here. Wait. Buh? <laughs> oh 
oh yeah, this, this person was telling me I can go all the way around, so guess what? I am. Um, can I, can I go back in? Past Barrel House? Barrel House? Wait, this is not the Barrel House, it is just a Barrel House. Out of the way! Okay, wait. Wait, past this Barrel House? Not this. This is a very confusing Nissan. It is. I'm I am considering not re-upping my lease because of this. Back up, down and to the left of the playhouse. Back up. Down. Wait, this is the playhouse, right? Let me just confirm. This is barrel house. Bar barrel house is playhouse. So we're gonna try left of here. Whoop. Oh, east from here. Oh, wait. Okay, wait. East. Aha. Aha. This looks promising. <gasps> Very promising. Kawako, I th by God, I think we've done it. I think you've done it. Hello, Grandma. You know, you're just because you're a prince, you can't go calling anyone Grandma. It's Bartholomew. Well, I'm okay. I'm doing all right. Sigurd keeps yelling at me. Hi, we're Bart's friends. <gasps> if you're friends with P, well, then you're friends with me. Oh wait, these are these are people accessories. Oh boy! Oh, ah, lifestone. Yeah, that's uh, boy. Holy pendants are good too. Double support effect times, huh? Are these usable when I'm in my gear? The hell is EP? I'm back from the store. Arby's for the store. What'd you get from the store? Is there anything I can sell? Evangelion points. Uh, is this just to sell? Holy Penny Ether Devil will affect you while in your gear. Yes. Woo. TP! Uh, need more TP. Gold nugget is to sell. Hey, well, we're gonna sell. Still can't afford an ether doubler, but we're getting there. Do I need this business fruit? Guess we'll just uh business on the outside, fruit on the inside. That's right, that's uh That's how they used to describe the mullet. Oh yeah, you're right, I gotta grind Satan's uh, death blows. And yeah, I can sell eyeballs, right? Those those are a whole bunch of nothing. Yeah, let's let's uh, let's go grind our green boy. Is what I would say, but I think I'm. <laughs> I think my time is almost up. You know what the music means. Our time here is up. Um, I'm gonna save here, but I'm gonna make a note that I am grinding. It's a place later that pays more for eyeballs, but you're locked in there for a while, and it's later on. All right. I am gonna save here, and I'm gonna make a note in my stream text. It says, hey buddy, you're grinding for ether doublers and for death blows. 
So let's because it is 3 a.m. here, and I gotta be up somewhat early tomorrow to go PC shopping. Xenogias. Xeno gears. Grind money for Ether Doublers. Grind Death Blows for Satan. Easy peasy. It has been fun. I am going to get some sleep. Thank you, Key Guar. Arby's, Kauruko, PC shopping. Excite? Space? I'm excited. Thanks, Vom. I know. Thank you, everybody, for watching. I gotta go to bed. Boy, Xeno Gears is, um... We're gonna get through it, everybody. We're gonna get through it, because we have... Health insurance. Rude night. Finish your week at work. Bye, Kauruko. Thank you. Keeg, space, cyanide. Uh, good, good night, and good luck. Bang.